With unemployment numbers soaring, more and more people are dealing with a new normal. And the way some are dealing is by helping each other out. Tonight, we check back in with a woman we've been following, and job team reporter Michelle Bowden finds an interesting support group that many people can learn from. It's at heart. They are the faces of the recession. Well, I was always in the financial industry. 24 years. I was in the subprime mortgage business. I worked in a uh, in IT. You know, it's kind of like uh, an AA meeting, you know. Uh, I'm Tim Jenkins and I'm unemployed. Come together to help each other get back to work. There's a couple of, of networking groups that I've that I've gotten in touch with. They each bring advice and ideas to the table. I talked with people in the same boat and try and share ideas and and contacts even, you know. Teresa, this group's host, has heard of some job openings. That's what I thought maybe we could do is just go through and share some resources. Tim's been to a career coach who told him. Never give out your resume unless they absolutely insist because that'll typecast you in what you've done. Chuck, our finance guy laid off after 24 years. Find people you can talk with and shake hands with. Is all about networking. Keep your eyes and ears open. There's contacts to be made and there's opportunities. Shay worries about what she calls the stigma of being unemployed and says just having the support system is priceless. It's nice to be around people that are in the same boat as you are. It's a way to join together and share ideas and try and lift each other up a little bit. Now, networking and support groups are really becoming common these days. Teresa formed her own. You can, too. But if you'd rather join a group that already exists, we've posted a list on our website. Just go to WCNC.com, click Job Team under the News tab. You can also call St. Matthew's Catholic Church in Ballantyne at 704-543-7677. They can give you information about their group and others in town. Reporting live now, Michelle Bowden, News Channel 36.